Abby, that is not possible, okay? I will love and support you whatever you want to do. But so, can you just try and talk me through your change of heart? I mean, last time we talked, you were really looking forward to having a baby of your own. Yeah, but that was before. So, before what? What's changed? I was just being an idiot. Having a baby wouldn't be convenient. What do you mean? What do you mean convenient? Yeah, like it would ruin things. For you? Or for Jamie? I don't think I can do this without him. I thought he was on board. I thought he was going to support you. Yes, yeah, so did I. And I thought, well, <sighs> hoped, really, that, you know, when I have this child, he's going to want us both. You know, fall in love with our little family. But I was just so stupid. Gabby. You're not being stupid to want love. Like, desperate, more like. No. Jamie thinks I am. He only wants Dawn. And he thinks me having this kid is going to ruin his life. He actually said that. He really hates me, Laurel. And the baby. He tried to trick me into getting rid of it. How can I have a child whose dad wishes it was never born? Visiting hours are over. Don't go. Can I just have a bit longer, please? One minute. Gabby, listen, Jamie has been unfair, unkind, um, and, and wrong. He's despicable. He's got nothing to do with your decision, OK? Jamie doesn't matter. But he's the dad. OK, so what if he wasn't around? What if he was out of the picture? Would you still keep the baby? Gabby? Yes. But that doesn't mean I should have it. You know, what if Jamie's right and I can't cope with the reality of having a kid? What if I'm not ready to do this on my own? But you're not on your own. You've got all of us around you to help. Well, Mum had a family, yet she still took off again and again. Me needing her wasn't enough for her to stick around when it really mattered. I can't do that to someone. But you won't. I mean, you're not Benice. Well, we don't know that. You know, it's Dad doesn't want it and it's Mum might not be able to cope. <laughs> But you will cope because you've got all of us around you to love and look after it, OK? That's not enough. No, no but listen. Listen, oh. it wasn't enough for me. I don't know what to do, Laurel. Whatever I do, I'm letting it down. What if there was another way? What if there was a third option? What? If you decide to keep him or her, then whatever you need, me and Jay can do it. We'll take care of everything. We'll look after your baby for you if, if that's what you want. What? We will raise your child as ours. If that is what you want. Can I just have one more minute, please? No, I'm sorry. You need to go now. She needs to sleep. OK, OK. I'm going to let you rest. But, Gabby, think about it. It might be the best option of all. <laughs>